Right, we're going to move on now to Friday's Guardian. And Leo, it seems like your queen is standing up to the UN. Uh, she's not my queen. It's Nicola Sturgeon. She's everybody's queen. She's rejected UN concerns about the reform of Scotland's gender law. So uh, there's a gender bill going through Scottish Parliament at the moment being scrutinised, although she says it's being scrutinised. Scotland's a one-party state, so it's yeah. scrutinised the same way as legislation is, is scrutinised in the Kremlin. But uh, the, the UN special rapporteur on violence against women and girls, mm. uh, she's called Reem Al-Salem, uh, criticised it. And uh, and um, because, because it could lead to it could give men uh, you know bad actors or just bad people uh, access to, to women only spaces mm. um, uh, because it, it replaces the sort of the requirement to go to a doctor and go through all these all these stages with you can just say you can just self identify as as a woman so I can yes. say I'm a woman then I'm a woman and I can just go to a women's jail or, or so whatever. why is it why is it Josh that Nicola Sturgeon I mean all of these feminist campaigners have pointed out the obvious problems with this the ways in which these kinds of loopholes have been exploited and have left led to uh, to further sexual assaults and this kind of thing mm -hmm. and she's saying quite explicitly there is no merit to these concerns mm. I'm not gonna make, she doesn't say let's talk, talk about it engage let's discuss she says no, not listening, no merit. She has been like fingers in her ears. Yeah. And then there was the event this week with a zero uh, tolerance violence uh, and somewhat she got heckled. And yes. But actually, she said something interesting. I don't know if you read, there was an interesting Spectator article today. For the first time, she kind of said something that could be construed as transphobic, according to trans activists, where she said that this could be exploited by bad actors. Yep. That's the first time that she sort of actually admitted that. They will say that's transphobic. Yeah, yeah and they would say that's well, like, transphobic.